everybody, welcome back to our channel. This is going to be the first episode of Foodie Friday for us. This episode is going to be rating and reviewing pretzels. Different flavored pretzels. We have about eight different flavors from this kind of local shop that's like mainly a website, but they're in so many stores around the United States. And we just happened to get our hands on probably way too many of them. But yeah, it started with one bag. If you guys watch my personal channel, which is linked down below, you'll have seen that in one of my last videos, we kind of taste tested the cinnamon roll one because it was at some like local place near us. And we found out that this place is like online and it's actually in 11 different states. So we were like, okay, this is pretty cool. Um, so we figured why not try them out and then like do a YouTube video and like share with you guys. Cause the cinnamon roll flavor is the only one we've tried, so we I have like gonna... seven or eight other flavors we have not tried. So. And this is not even all of the flavors they have. I think they have a total of like 15. Yeah, we just picked the ones that we figured we would like because um, we didn't want to like waste a ton of money on stuff that we just weren't going to eat. I didn't want to throw it away. So, anyway. And the camera died. Well, I guess now we have to get into the taste test. So here we go. Yes. We have nine different flavors. This might take a while. A little bit. First one we're gonna try is salt and vinegar. She's probably not gonna like this, but I will. It was his choice. These aren't you. You have to. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whatever. This might take the longest part. You didn't even like rip the other side. What the heck? They don't want us to try these. They're so good. They're sacred. Bro, what the heck? Why is the bloopers just going to be us opening the bag? There we go. Maybe. There we go. I don't even know if I even want to smell them. So, I don't like I like salt and vinegar. vinegar stuff. I've never had salt and vinegar stuff, so this is a first for me. I have my drink here just in case. Not sponsored, but yeah. Mm -hmm. It smells so good. <laughs> We're very different. That smells so bad. We're gonna rank these at the end, and our rankings are going to be very different based on how the oh different my God. flavors we have. Like, it smells like a fucking bottle of vinegar. If you're not a salt and vinegar <laughs> fan, you'll agree with her. But if you like salt and vinegar, let us know in the comments really like what flavor you guys think you would probably like out of these. Are you a salt and vinegar person? Because are you making a? She just pulled out a notepad on her phone. Are you making a list? I, yeah, I just pulled out a notepad on my phone. Let me get my pen. <laughs> it's literally called notepad. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Acts <laughs> like I'm eighty. Meanwhile, eighty-one. Anyway, um, so yeah. Um, get one, let's try it. Ew, I don't want to try a whole one. I want to try like a little baby piece of one. Oh my god. Uh, where's a small piece? You can bite off a small piece. I'm going to vomit it right up anyway. This is even too big. Alright, ready? Three, two, one. Ew. I... I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> I totally disagree with you. Oh, it's like staining my tongue. Uh, no, that tastes good. That tastes good. No. Yeah, that tastes good. I like that. I can already tell it's not gonna be my favorite. But I do like it. And I'm going to do the same thing as you because I'm going to forget my ratings. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to pull up a notepad on my phone. It's so well. disgusting. Oh my god. No, that tastes good. That tastes good. So 10 being the worst? No, 10 is, 10 is like... Or do you want the... 10 is the best. 10 is really good. Okay. 1 is like you absolutely hate it. I gotta close this thing up because this is disgusting. <laughs> Where's the trash can? No, I'll keep those. <laughs> I'll eat those. All right. Oh, it's, it's still in my mouth. That's what it's this disgusting. one you'll like better. The next flavor is 
cheddar cheese. <laughs> we got the cheddar. And we'll make the cheddar if you subscribe and put the turn the post notifications on. No, I can't do a shameless plug for him. All right. Okay. Yes, please do subscribe though and give this video a thumbs up. And interact with us in the comments because we actually like, read your comments and we respond. So. Meanwhile, I'm like. It smells good. I was like, I'm already gonna like this. So I just grabbed one, a whole one. <laughs> All right, cheddar cheese. Wait, which? All right, let's try these finally. Three, two, one. These ain't got nothing on combos. No, these are way better. That's true. That's really good. I like that one a lot. That's really... Wow. That's really good. These are like way better than combos, actually. I agree. I really do agree. Mm, way better. Wow. Alright. So far, that's... That's a high contender for the best one. Mm. I mean, so far at least, I should say. Alright. Alright. What's see. next? Next. Oh, I'm excited for this one. What one? The next flavor we're trying is deep dish pizza. This sounds really good. Alright. Add to our newt. <laughs> I said pause of pizza. <laughs> I can spell, don't worry. Pretty sure I was at your high school graduation. <laughs> and I was at yours. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't get the joke. Or am I just that stupid? <laughs> <laughs> That's up for interpretation. I was meaning, like, you said you know how to spell? Yeah. I would hope so, because I was at your high school graduation. Oh, that makes sense. Do, do, do. Shut up. Ooh. That's different. It doesn't taste like pizza. It, it smells like the crust. It doesn't taste like pizza. Shut up. It smells like the crust of a pizza. <laughs> I don't know why. Here we go. It's a pretzel. It's a pizza pretzel. <laughs> Let's try these on. Yeah. I'm a fan. I don't know how I feel. I'm a fan. Really? Look, I would eat these. I would, but I don't know how I feel about them. Like, I wouldn't gravitate towards these first, I don't think. Are you done? For now, I guess, because we have to keep trying different flavors. <laughs> this is really one. hard. Hmm? You have another one. I will later. <laughs> <laughs> On her channel, we, had, we tried the cinnamon roll ones. And I'm not even kidding you. I woke up the next morning to go to work. Keep in mind, I have to wake up at 6 a.m. to go to work. And I get a text from her saying, babe, we need to talk about something. I'm like, what? She finished the bag. In like less than 12 hours. In less than 12 hours. hours, she finished the bag. So once and we it, get to that these one. These bags are three and a half servings, uh, one ounce of They're serving. not small bags at all. It's a good amount in there. And I had it gone. I just like. Now speaking of. Speaking of the devil, cinnamon, my favorite cinnamon roll pretzels. We're gonna try. We've tried them before, but we gotta try them for the video. We gotta try them again. Who knows? Maybe it was a fluke, and that batch was just better. Yeah, he didn't like it the first time because he said it was like too much of a cinnamon taste. But I was obsessed from the start, and I am beyond excited for these. So. D Are you gonna eat them? Yes. <laughs> I was gonna talk first. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> All right. Cheese. <laughs> That's a blooper. <laughs> You're so stupid. 
<laughs> All right, go ahead. I'm not holding you back anymore. <laughs> I have to admit. I feel like these are sweeter. They are. Why are these? These ones are a lot better than the other bag we had. All mine. Hey, go for it. <laughs> go for it. I think we got like three of these cinnamon roll bags. Not even we did. <laughs> we definitely did. Alright. The next one, which I'm very... I don't know how I'm going to feel about this one. We have mm. Buffalo Ranch. So this one's gonna be probably a little bit more spicy. Yeah, I'm kind of afraid because we got sweet and then we're gonna go to spicy. Run I don't know how I feel. Completely off the rails on the crazy train. Anyway. Any Ozzy Osbourne fans or just plastic rock fans in general? This says Buffalo Ranch. Let me type. Let me. Buffalo let me Ranch. write this down really quick. Let me quick. write it down. Because this is, after this one, we have three more flavors to try. Is that right? No, four. I was wrong. We have four more after this. And you graduated high school. Shut the hell up. <laughs> All right, let's try Buffalo Ranch. All right, let's go. <laughs> this one's smaller. I'm afraid I'm not going to like it. Alright. This is what it looks like. You can't see because of my face. Mmm. Ew. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That is like yucky, spicy. I don't know. I'm. It's subtle, like for me at least. It's not too bad, spicy wise, but. <laughs> it's just like not <laughs> <the> wise. <laughs> Reroll. It's not. Reroll. Rewind. Rewind. Hold up. Back the tractor up. Oh, the here we go. Here, the tractor back. again. Good goddamn tractor. <laughs> <laughs> Right. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I feel after my mouth because it's like just on fire right now. And that's that that's right really alone. spicy to you? Yeah. Or I can feel like, the spice, the heat. I kind of liked it. Was, it wasn't bad. Like if you I like more spicy. Of a ranch flavor, but. Like if you like spicy food, you'll like this. I'm like not huge on spicy food. Like I like spicy food if it's subtle, but this is like a little much for me. Maybe I'll change the rating when I initially gave it. Hmm. I think I'm gonna give it that. Okay. No. Okay. This next flavor we have. Oh, that's the Memphis, Memphis barbecue. barbecue. Speaking of hot stuff, I'm sure this will be hot. Barbecue? Do we talk about barbecue? <laughs> <laughs> At least never like barbecue. <laughs> oh, that, oh yeah. I remember that. And then it was nothing but barbecue chips and barbecue sauce with nuggets and fries. Yes. You would, you would, we would go to a drive through like, or we would go like to like Chick-fil-A. Yeah, Wendy's or, or even Chick-fil-A. We would go like... to Chick-fil-A and she'd complain that we didn't get enough uh, barbecue sauce. When, keep in mind, we got a, maybe a 12 nugget to share and two things of fries. And they gave us, I'm almost done. They, they gave, us, they like gave us like four. Two, two or four, yeah, something like they that. They gave us like four things of barbecue sauce and you complained that it wasn't enough. No. Cause I can blow through like two packets. No, no, we're not. I, I got it. I got it. See, it's open. It's open, guys. Oh, oh this that's is the, the one, one that's open. Both of them bottom. <laughs> you were going to dump it out the <laughs> other side? Oh, it smells good. It smells good. That's interesting. I'm taking this half piece. 
piece. We need a counter on the screen of how many times she said interesting in this in this video. All right, ready? No. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. 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 That is... That is... I'm, I'm not gonna lie, that might be tied for my favorite. As she's cleaning her palette because she doesn't like it. That's okay. I definitely like it better than the Buffalo Ranch, but it's like just a lot of seasoning on I'm one need bit of a pretzel. <laughs> I'm gonna need to change my ratings after we're done. Yeah, we can do that. We can look and adjust her ratings accordingly. All right, let's try this one. Cheese boogers. Cheese boogers. Cheese burgers. I don't know. I think this is gonna be really similar to the cheddar cheese, and like I don't think there's gonna be too much of a difference. But I agree. Like, how can you from cheese and cheeseburger like how are you gonna get like meat flavor in there? Like, I don't know. That's gonna be interesting. So now try the burger. Little cheese burger. Cheese burger. Yeah, you do. All right, ready? Three, two, one. That's weird. Mm. I don't know. That one's really odd. That it says you can instantly taste the grease from the grill, toasted bun, pickles, and cheeseburger without the guilt of 800 plus calorie burger. Have you ever had like... Do you want more? Okay for right now. I don't know, that's just weird. Have you ever had like, like a smoked bacon flavor? Like the smokiness of it? Yeah. It feels like, like they tried like... to add that into the pretzels, but it's just not working. Yeah, it's like you could really just taste it. Like your mouth just felt like it was like... I don't know how to describe it's, it. I don't know it, but it wasn't bad. I still like it, but it's just weird. I don't know. Yeah. I really don't know how to describe that. Um, What's our next flavor? Garlic ranch. Hmm. We have some garlic ranch flavor. This one's interesting. I don't know if I'm gonna like this, but we'll have to have to see. What I like about this company and their uh, what they do with their pretzels is they don't over like season, I guess. Yeah, they're not like overloaded with them. Like it probably looks like a lot of seasoning in there, but it's really not. It's not a lot at all. Like especially when you look at the cheese one, a lot of cheese things are heavily coated. It, yeah, we know you want the cinnamon roll. Let's finish this all and then. Okay, fine. <sighs> Can't really smell them. You can smell the garlic. I took a tiny as Kate. Let's try it. That's not bad. It's a little overpowering on the range. Yeah. Yeah, ooh. The aftertaste is like all ranch. Yes, it's like if you consumed ranch powder. Yeah. But on a pretzel. <laughs> it's like you consumed ranch powder, but on a pretzel. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and oh no, there was, it's not too bad. And there's like a hint of a garlic taste. So like it's, to me, it's not like an overpowering garlic taste. I like garlic and ranch, so. Yeah. This I, is like a good combo. It's a good combo, I definitely. Like I, it, I would get that again. Yeah. I definitely would get that again. Mm -hmm. All right. What's next? The final one. It's the final countdown. Is definitely Why the most favorite. Anyway. 
<laughs> we have chocolate, chocolate covered, covered pretzels. pretzels. I mean, come on, if these aren't our number one by default. We just um, had dinner and I was actually wanting like, a sweet, like, kind of treat to eat afterwards and I didn't know what it was. I'm like, wondering. What I wanted. And I think these are probably gonna be really good. I'm wondering if this is going to be milk, milk or chocolate or dark chocolate. I don't know. It's hard to tell. It kind of smells like. It smells like dark chocolate. It smells like dark chocolate. I don't know. We'll try it. Let's do it. Alright. Ready? <laughs> I can't tell. But these are addicting, I can tell you that. <laughs> what, kind of, what kind of chocolate is that? Right? It's not like, it's not sweet like a milk chocolate, but it's not as like bitter as like a dark chocolate. Mm-hmm. And it's not because of the salt of the pretzel either. No. This is, really a, this is some really good chocolate though. This is some really good chocolate. Wow. That's really good. That has, yeah. I think this is honestly one of the best chocolate covered pretzels I've had. Mm-hmm. Because I feel like with other like like chocolate covered pretzels that I have, or that I've had had, um, it's either way too much chocolate or way too much like saltiness of the pretzel. Yeah, I don't know how to like describe it. It's I'm gonna have another one. I want to taste like, it. Like I've always had like the um the flips chocolate covered pretzels or like the white chocolate covered um, and they're always okay, but the chocolate is just like I don't know. It's not it, I guess. And um, this is like really good. I don't know what kind of chocolate they use, but this is like so good. Really addicting. Wow. That is it. So the chocolate covered for me and the cinnamon roll come in a tie. I'll have to say that. I have. I Do have you need to make, a second? I definitely need a second. Okay. To make my list. Commercial break. All right, and we are back from commercial break. Hope you guys enjoyed your little bathroom break. Going and grabbing a snack, refilling your coffee. Um, yeah. Anyways. Um, so we're gonna get back into the video. So um, yeah, it's final countdown. So. Yeah. Um, so <laughs> we're gonna be rating these all nine flavors from worst, one we absolutely hate and could go in the garbage for all we care. No offense to this company, but it's just trash. Not not the company. Not the company. The, so, the like the flavor. certain flavors. The flavor. Just to our taste. So. And then we'll go to the best one. Yes, so first on my list is the salt and vinegar is the absolute worst. It's disgusting. It can go in the trash. Um, I never care to eat it again. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're just going to leave that there. It is disgusting. Next up is a cheeseburger. There was just something about it, like a distinct thing about it. I did not like. What is that? I just did not like, and um, yeah, it was gross. Not that great. Anyway. Um, and then the Buffalo Ranch, it was just that one. And then the next one is the Memphis Barbecue. I think if I wouldn't have had those two back to back, maybe I could have gave like a better um, like review on them. But since they were both kind of on the hotter side, it was kind of hard to tell. But the seasoning was a little heavy on the Memphis Barbecue as well. Um, the next one is going to be Garlic Ranch. The ranch is just very, very very overpowering like if they dialed it back just a bit on the ranch it would have been perfect but it was just a little too ranch like powdery tasting um and next would be deep dish pizza i just i mean it's okay it's okay it Could, definitely ranks better than the others but was it one of those where like it's good but you can't see yourself getting to the bottom of the bag kind of yeah it's like right in that rank. That middle ranking is like it's good to have like a little handful, but there you can't see yourself like, getting to the bottom no. and finishing it. No, not at all. But the cheddar cheese, I could probably see that happening with because that one was pretty good actually. And of course, the last two 
in order our chocolate and cinnamon roll so the cinnamon roll ranks as the best salt and vinegar is the worst ever <laughs> there was no way even even the ch chocolate coated ones there's no way anything was beating cinnamon roll for you no there was nothing like no it was a close tie you. i honestly had a debate back and forth i'm like well, which one is really the best um and cinnamon roll <laughs> it just wins it just does so anyway all right take it away so my list at coming in at number nine the one that i just don't care about i put the cheeseburger there's just that weird like false smoky taste that's just yeah if i'm gonna have cheeseburger i'm gonna eat real cheeseburger yeah i don't want to be healthy and have a pretzel i want the 800 plus calories <laughs> yeah right <laughs> exactly <laughs> Next for me, even though I do like the flavor of it, is salt and vinegar. I like the flavor of it, but everything else was just better for me. Like, yeah, I mean, could definitely eat those. I, I could definitely snack on them. It's just, the other flavor is just better. I uh, coming that. in at number seven for me was buffalo. I do like the little bit of spice, but it's just way too overpowering and... If there's not enough with the pretzel, if I'm comparing it to like, if I'm gonna get like a buffalo like chicken wing, mm -hmm. there's more on like a chicken wing per bite that can like counteract how much spice there is. With True. the pretzel, it, there's not. It just, it's like, just the spice. Yeah. It's just the spice. So it's a little too overpowering for me. Mm -hmm. um, coming down to number six was the garlic ranch. Garlic ranch was definitely very good. I could, I could eat a good amount of that, but it's just the aftertaste of that was just not enough. It was, it just wasn't, I don't know, it wasn't good. It yeah. like left you with the kind of film on your throat a little bit. Yeah, it was, there was just something about it that was, it was just too powdery, I think is yeah. what it was. Coming in, it, I have a tie for fourth and fifth place it is the cheddar cheese. Which is it's good. I can definitely see myself finishing that bag, for sure. Yeah. And don't hate me, but the cinnamon roll. <laughs> cinnamon roll comes in at, like, number four. For me, personally, I want, like, a little bit of, like, a like a sprinkle of, like, a glaze or something on it. Just to add some more, like, a little bit more sweetness to it to remind me more of a cinnamon roll. It is really good though. I have to admit, I have to agree with you. It is really, really it's good. So addicting, you guys. This bag is gonna be gone by tomorrow. I'm not even kidding. Yes, yeah, so we have this bag open and we have the chocolate coated. Did you get a second bag of chocolate coated? I didn't. <gasps> this is gonna be a problem. Okay, next okay. with your ratings. All right, so now I'm at my top three. Coming in at number three for me was Memphis Barbecue. I really like barbecue a lot, and for that, that flavor was just, that I could get really addicted to. Get I, really addicted to. I like to. barbecue, but that was just like a little different for me. Of course, I've never had anything that's like more Memphis Barbecue, it's just been like straight up barbecue. Um, Memphis Barbecue is definitely a distinct taste for as far as barbecue goes. It is distinct, I will say that. It's not bad. I like it. It's just a little... It's different than what I'm used to, but I still like it. Alright, top two now. My it's second favorite... not cinnamon roll. I'm just kidding. Which means there's more for you. Just we also... <laughs> with it. I also have another bag of it right here. I thought you had three bags. No, we doubled. We doubled. We didn't triple on any of them. I'm going to have to order more after this video, so pray for my wallet. But anyways, at number two for me was the deep dish pizza. I really love that flavor. That was amazing. Uh, like, I could... I could eat multiple bags of the deep dish pizza. And obviously, number one, the chocolate. It's the chocolate, people. The chocolate. It's not, the chocolate wasn't overpowering like I thought it was gonna be. Mm -mm. I was like, if you get, if you go to um, like fudge stores and stuff like that where you get the chocolate pretzels, yeah. 
the chocolate is just so overpowering. You don't get anything else with it. Yeah, and then like there's like a bit of salt, but it's like you're literally crunching on a little chunk of salt. So but this, that was like a perfect, perfect. blend. Absolutely perfect. But yeah, that's all nine flavors. I'm really, I'm yes. really excited about this because now I want to order a lot more. <laughs> yeah, and I think that we will because we're gonna need more of these chocolate covered pretzels and these cinnamon roll pretzels because these cinnamon roll pretzels are gonna be gone. I mean, they seriously will be. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> they will be gone. Comparison <laughs> right now for you guys to see. <laughs> Tomorrow morning they will be gone. <laughs> Ten minutes later. So we ordered five more bags and they're already gone too. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Anyways, I think that is all for this video. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Um, what flavor you think you may like. Um, How do you think you would rate these? On a scale of one to ten, honestly. There's yeah, a lot. Like, rate them in the comments what you think. I mean, I know it's different like than tasting them, but just from like I guess the title and how we kind of describe them, like, what would you pick? Or tell us what your number one would be because because there was if a few, it's not cinnamon roll, then what are you doing with your life? There was a few that definitely surprised me. Like when we were looking at the list online, like the garlic ranch ones, I was like, eh, maybe, but I don't know. We were iffy about that. But it's like some of these are really freaking good. It's definitely fun, and I mean, it's pretty affordable just to like get and try these because I think they have what a buy three get one, or they have like so, a buy two. Yeah, get I one. think right now it was, so. it was like uh, buy three get one free, and then over thirty five dollars is just free shipping. Yeah, so, so it we was just really maxed nice. it out at thirty five, and then just and we still got. I mean, this is such a good. Steal, like, it's a good size stuff. for what you pay. I have to admit, it's a really good size it's bag like for three dollars. Uh, a bag? Yeah, everything except like the chocolate covered was like I think three ninety nine online. Yeah, something like that. Something like so, that. It was really good. Yeah. yeah. We want to do more like food challenges, yes. more uh, like challenges against each other, cooking challenges. We both are really into cooking, mm -hmm. and honestly, we're big food addicts. Uh, yes, we've recently like really gotten into like all this food stuff and like writing things and like cooking and like what would taste good with this what could we put with this so we're really getting into it and i don't know we thought it'd just be fun to like share and then we could like look back on this later and you know definitely all that stuff so leave us some yeah. leave us some challenges as well cooking challenges against each other uh, we had idea of uh going to the grocery store and we each had to we only have like 15 dollars to spend but we have to make a whole meal out of it mm -hmm. like Stuff like that we are really interested in doing. Just want to know your feedback on it and leave your challenges down below. And who knows, we might try them. Yes. So we're super excited to do more challenges, more Foodie Friday videos. So, um, yeah, if you guys, I can't guarantee that there's going to be a Foodie Friday video every single Friday. Uh, but we'll try to, like, get one out as often as we can. Um, so, yeah, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And leave a comment down below. Let us know um, your challenge ideas and what you think your favorite pretzel flavor would be. And um, I'll have their information linked if you guys want to check them out. Like I said, they're like in 11 different states, but I think they ship all throughout the U.S. So you don't have to like live in those states to try it because, I mean, we just had to ship. It took a, like... It took, I think, three a few, days. A few days or something like that, so. It was really, it was pretty fast. Yeah, so anyways, we will see you guys in the next video. Please make sure that you subscribe as well. Turn that button, that red button, gray, white, whatever, what, whatever color it is. Turn it purple if you have the opportunity. Okay, anyways, <laughs> we will see you guys in the next video. Now on to bloopers. Bye. And this is why you work at a job. The only goddamn times I had to play that in marching band. <laughs> Let me assist.
spitting <laughs> down the bag. Yeah, open. Stop, it works. I got it. Now open it. I'm and out. open it. <laughs> I'm totally just teasing with him, by the way. Like, when we act this way with each other, we're totally kidding, and we both know this. We just, We've just acted like this since day one. So, we, some of you guys might be, like, maybe a little, like, disturbed or, like, weirded out by our relationship, but that's just us. That's and just, that's just us. A, like, our way of, I don't know, communication or something. I don't know. We, we mess around daily if we're not stupid or we're not being idiots Something's with each other <laughs> we need to go to a doctor <laughs> like something is just wrong so anyway so let me guys let me guys let me go anyway doesn't this look like my hair <laughs> what no not at all <laughs> I'm colorblind. It doesn't look anything like your hair. But like the goldenness to it. Okay, <laughs> that's a that's a that's a look at my cheddar cheese halo. Like what? <laughs> you make me laugh too much. <laughs> Is that a bad thing? <coughs> I mean, I'll check that for you. Alright. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm the only mature one here, and this is... Excuse you? 